I'm back with one more video um, from my Vancouver trip. Um, even though I got lots of product from the London Drugs Beauty event, I also did a little shopping while I was there, obviously. Um, so one of the first places I went was Winners, because I love Winners. You can find so many cool things there. So I got three things there. I found a L'Oreal Color Infallible eyeshadow in Burning Black, which is a cool wine color. I found the mineral from the Dead Sea Magic Mud Mask, because I can't turn up masks. And Good Things Totally Wipe Out Cleansing Wipes in Superfruit Extracts, Raspberry and Cranberry, and because I was all out of wipes already, so I picked those up. And those were each $3, so how could I not get them all? Um, I also went to Crabtree and Evelyn and got two little hand creams. I got the Caribbean Island Wildflowers and Evelyn Rose. So I use a ton of hand cream and these ones are really awesome. So I wanted to get some more teas while I was there. Um, the David's Tea at the mall that I went to in Richmond was closed for renovation. So I went to Tivana, which had um, a really nice sample. I tried one and they had it labeled as Raspberry Limeade. And I went, when I went in, I was like, ooh, I really like that one. I really want the one. And she told me that it was actually a mixture of two teas. So I got Raspberry Balsamico and Limeade Twist. So they had it as a, as a cold iced tea, which was really yummy, so I plan to make that. As well as I also picked up a Berry Berry White. I really love berry teas. So I get to try those. And I went to the face shop, and when I went in, they had a really helpful girl working. And so I told her that I have combination skin and I wanted to get some face masks and maybe some cleanse, a new cleanser to try. So I got five real nature masks. I got mung bean, lemon, kelp, bamboo, and a kaya berry. So these are all sheet masks, so they'll have lots of fun self-mask faces. I also got the Herb Day 365 Cleansing Foam in Cerola, Acerola. I don't know how to pronounce it. This is the one she told me to try with combination skin. So when she was checking me out, she also gave me a couple samples. I got two samples of Mango Sea Cleansing Foam and two other cleansing butter, as well as a box of cotton pads. So they reused their boxes for their samples, so it's just cotton pads inside a box for something else, which was really nice. I really liked their samples. Oh, and I totally forgot, I also picked up some Herb Day Cleansing Tissue, because um, again, like I said, I was out of face wipes, and how can you resist? So one of the main things I really wanted to do was go to Sephora. I've never actually been to Sephora. Um, it's kind of like the scary makeup place. So when I went in, um, one of the girls was really helpful. She came over and asked me if I was looking for anything. I said, I really want to get an eyeshadow primer. I have the Urban Decay one, and I want to try something else. So when she asked if my lids are dry or oily, and I told her oily, so she, she suggested I pick up the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. So I did. And they have all these lovely things by the cash so I picked up the lash stash to go because mascara can't resist and the girl checking me out wasn't very friendly and I didn't get any samples because of that so as I was leaving the mall there was someone standing there handing out toothpaste so I also got toothpaste um, Colgate sensitive pro relief toothpaste I'm a Colgate girl so I'll try these for sure so that was my shopping stash I stayed really low um, low budget because I was already doing a massive trip to Vancouver and I already had a massive bag of stuff to take home. I didn't really need to buy a whole lot. So that was my shopping haul.